Hello everyone, this is the React Native Beginner Series. In this video, I want to show you how to use the Refresh uh, Controller in React Native. So Refresh Controller is the built-in React Native component. So we are using uh, inside the scroll view and list view or flat list. So, so this is the usage of the Refresh Controller like uh, where the scroll view uh, goes to the zero so it show indicator active indicator so how to use this in react native so let's go to the practical so for that we need to uh, save area view also and also scroll view we can use it in the inside the scroll view so i will give a style also style flex one and also style for the my scroll view flex one now I need a one state cons and is refresh set is refresh your state in the starting value by default it's false and just come to the your scroll view now I need to add text also to show you text I just copied the text from here and just paste it so see this is our text so I need a margin from the top like uh, 40 and now just come here and just uh, type refresh controller and also import your refresh controller refresh controller from the react native and a refresh controller refreshing just type your state is refresh see we import our refresh controller from the react native uh, so ju i'm just passing the true value in the state and just uh, reload see our refresh controller is working but we don't have any control to the refresh controller for that we need a function like a const and on refresh and just arrow function and there set refresh true and also we need a set timeout set timeout and and set timeout after some time we should false our state so set refresh uh, false your state and after 100 millisecond and yes uh, copy your uh, function to the refresh on refresh on refresh on and paste it so now if you are close my app and just open see we don't have any see any so just me let me uh, false it the value see if i scroll it down so our refresh controller is showing so now I need a more time also a uh, thousand millisecond. So if I refresh it, so it take a one second to, so if I refresh it, so it take a one second to refresh my whole component. See, so this is the refresh controller in react native. So for the using the refresh controller, we need a state. Also we need a function and also we need a, a set timeout. So after some time we need to stop our refresh controller. So this is for today. See you in next video.